need to concentrate. I was going to say if you've been drinking much wine, you know, you haven't been, but maybe you've got a better chance of understanding this. <laughs> How many bottles have you put away tonight? <laughs> Where's Jesus when you do? <laughs> many, many years ago, when I was 23, I was married to a widow who was pretty as could be. This widow had a grown-up daughter who had hair of red. My father fell in love with her, and soon the two were wet. This made my dad my son-in-law, which changed my very life. My daughter was my mother, since she was my father's wife. And to complicate the matter, even though it brought some joy, I soon became the father of a bouncing baby boy. Well, the little baby then became a brother-in-law to dad. And thus became my uncle, though it made me very sad. For if he was my uncle, then he also was the brother of the widow's grown-up daughter, who of course was my stepmother. And I'm my own grandpa. I'm my own grandpa. It sounds funny, I know, but really it's so. I'm my own grandpa. This song is not from Bushmills. <laughs> the father's wife then had a son who kept him on the run. He became my grandchild since he was my daughter's son. My wife is now my father's mother and it makes me blue. Although she is my wife, she is my grandmother too. Well, if my wife is my grandmother, then I'm her grandchild. Every time I think of it, it nearly drives me wild. For now I have become the strangest case you ever saw. As husband of my grandmother, I am my own grandpa. And I'm my own grandpa. Let's hear you. I'm my own grandpa. It sounds funny, I know, but really, it's so. I'm my own grandpa. Yes, I'm my own grandpa.